record. So, okay, so um, uh, I'm going to sort of talk about what if a spiritual seeker is facing, you know, is finding things very, very difficult, um, is kind of in despair, like uh, when does the happiness come, feeling guilt, um, feeling pain, um, and, you know, this feeling almost a lack of overwhelm. And my experience with that is that these things do arise and what is um, so um, and there are um, I don't particularly enjoy it when life gets very very difficult and there's overwhelming feelings or difficulties in life but for me then that's the thing of um, uh, uh, karmic undoing karmic undoing which means that um, it's almost like um, the intensity the intensity of um, of karma, of beliefs, of uh, identification with baggage, with history, uh, it's like everything starts to hit and it becomes quite uh, extremely excruciating. So for myself with those, um, the way I handle those is um, is to have um, acceptance. And, you know, I sometimes feel like that, that that is the thing of, you know, it's like you've got to pay off you know I sort of see it from a karmic level like if if I've been selfish in the past in this lifetime and past lifetimes sometimes there is this thing where um, it comes to you know it comes back and it's like the world is hitting you left right and center and um, and one has just to, to, one has to take it in a spiritual way as possible so I mean I do that always with um, prayer praying to, to God for divine mercy in the situation, for grace, for reprieve. Um, I will always try and intuit, you know, I can always usually get a good intuition because whatever's happening to me is in some effect, something I've done to others or to the world, which is now, well, I, I call it karmic, uh, uh, I forgot, karmic undoing. Yes, that's the right word, karmic undoing. It's like, for example, if I've been, um, if, if I've been a bad parent in this lifetime and past lifetime, sometimes I'm having great difficulties with, um, with children, or it can be like, you know, I've lived with people, I probably, you know, I, I reckon I've probably had uh, 10 or 11, 15 lifetimes. So I've probably been a person that's been a nightmare to live with and created pain, suffering, distress, um, you know, probably living with me was like a, like a horror, horror movie at some time for some people. And so now it's like I start to feel the experiences of what I've inflicted on them. And that's karmic undoing. Uh, and that for me is the thing of, it's, it's extremely unpleasant. And of course I do pray like a maniac and do do all the spiritual things I can do to call in the divine and experience the presence. Of, of, of the divine, that infinite peace and love, uh, uh, and that where all of this stuff drops away. But sometimes even if it doesn't come, you know, I'm doing the observer, I'm praying like a lunatic, I'm doing everything I can, reading the Course of Miracles, and it's still here, then it's like there's the acceptance that this must be gone through until it passes. And to do the spiritual work uh, as I'm guided to, I often uh, intuit like, um, I really like one of my teacher's prayers, you know, to pray for forgiveness for the one in me who's done this to others. Let's say I was going through a very dark, dark period and the thought was coming to mind, when does the happiness come? Well, I would intuit then I've lived with someone in the past and that's probably been their thought. Like, when will the happiness come? Living with this guy is just awful, you know, and I, I've, I've sort of... Uh, you know, created a lot of torment for a long period of time. So I can I can pray forgiveness for the one in me, who has been um, who has tormented others, or created torment, or or distress, or uh, through my selfish actions, whatever. And so um, I also see um, it's a karmic undoing. You know, sometimes there isn't. You know, I can't get rid of it. And so there's the acceptance that I have to undo it through experience. Uh, and then I'll do that. So um, guilt, you know, the guilt, the, you know, um, guilt is also a thing, you know, um, if I can ask, what is the guilt about? 
um, wanting relief. Sometimes these things are gone through that way. Uh, so yeah, okay. I will um, 